Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. We're gonna do something a little bit different. I haven't done this. I've seen other creators do it, but starting today, December 1st, um, I'm gonna do 12 days of tutorials. So every other day, I'm gonna upload a new video on an eyeshadow palette and give you a holiday look with that palette. I am gonna be taking requests on eyeshadow palettes or specific looks you wanna, you know, you wanna see. So down in the description box below is gonna be a list of the eyeshadow palettes that I do own. So if you wanna see a tutorial on a particular palette, make sure you comment on the video, on this video and I will try and include that in the 12 days of tutorials. So I will be uploading a new tutorial every other day, which will lead up to the 24th, which is Christmas Eve. Again, I am gonna be doing holiday looks, so looks that are gonna be good for the holidays, whether they're gonna be glam or just you know basic minimal, I will be doing something that's gonna be holiday specific. So for day number one, we are gonna be using the Sigma Beauty, the Dream Palette from Sigma and Beauty Bird. I've actually never used this palette before, so I'm really excited to use this for the first time with you guys. So let me prime my eyes, I'll zoom you in, and we will get started. All right, I zoomed you in, and the eye primer I used is the Rare Beauty Eye Primer, and then I set it with a little bit of powder. This is my go-to, my absolute favorite eye primer. It works absolutely phenomenal. Let's get started. So I'm gonna start with the shade Boo Boo with a Sigma E38, and I'm gonna start by putting that in the crease, and I'm gonna use this as like my transition shade. I'm gonna go into the shade Tacos and Chill with a Sigma E24, and that is gonna go in my crease as well. And I'm also gonna put that on the outer lid. Went back to that first brush and that first shade, and I'm just going to gently blend the two shades together. Next, I'm gonna take 805 with a Morphe Jaclyn Hill JH37 brush. And that's gonna go on the outer lid up into the outer crease. Went back to my Sigma E24 and I didn't put any product on it and I'm just gonna kind of blend over the green shade I just put down. Mm -hmm. 
Now I'm gonna take Maya, I think that's how you say it, with a Sigma E58. And I am gonna spray my brush with a little bit of setting spray. And I'm gonna put that where the green shade on my lid meets the, meets the empty space on my lid so it's a more seamless blend. With the same brush, I'm gonna take the shade Malegro, and then that is gonna go on the rest of my lid that is open. going back to the green shade and putting that on towards the like end of my lid and I meant the green shimmer shade uh, Maya Maya I guess that's how you say it And then I went back to the green matte shade called 8 to 5, I think it's called 805. I'm just kind of stamping that on the outer part of my lid again. And then back to my Sigma E24, just to gently blend on top of that shimmer shade. I'm gonna go back into Tacos and Chill with a Refer 26 brush, and that is gonna go along my lower lash line. the same brush I went into 805 which is that matte green shade and I'm just putting that on the outer part of my lower lash line I'm going into Frenchie with a Sigma E42. I'm going to use that to blend out the lower lash line. Back to the shade Malegro, Malegra and I'm gonna put that just on the inner corner of my lower lash line, and I'm gonna use this as an inner corner highlight. That is it. Let me go do the liner and lashes and I'll be back to show you the finished look. All right, I am back and here's the finished look.
So what I added is for highlight, you see the green. I absolutely love it. I use the Michaela Glam Light Pot 2 Highlight Trio. I use the middle shade Blinden. I love that it's like this green hue. I think it's beautiful. For the wing liner, I use the Tom Ford Eye Defining Pen. I have some Ardell Wispy Lashes on, and then I put some brown liner, liner in the waterline. So this is the finished look. I think it would be, I mean, this can be glam or just minimal for the holidays. It's not like super glam, but it's not like super minimal boring. You know what I mean? Um, I think it turned out really well. And the dream palette. Oh my goodness. Like I said, this was the first time I used this and I love it. It blended out beautifully. I can't wait to use this palette more. So that is it for day one on the 12 days of tutorials on day two, which will be in two days from now. I will upload a, another tutorial um, down in the description box below. I will link everything that I use, the palette, everything else that's on my face. I will also have the list of eyeshadow palettes that I do own that um, if you want to see a certain eyeshadow palette, you want to see a tutorial with it, make sure you let me know. Comment down below and let me know. Or if there's a certain look you want me to do, let me know because I'm all for doing whatever you want. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you on day two.